Hey guys, what's up? So today, my wife and her sister Gabby here with us and we've all decided that we're quite hungry and we wanted to go and get something a little bit different today to eat and I haven't had a shark and bacon in a very very long time so I reached out to my friends at Havana Titi at Maracas Beach and we're heading up there now to go and get some amazing food from them I can't wait, I'm bringing along these two beauties with me say hi guys Hi. and Stephanie maybe you can show Gabby how we um, take us out <laughs> into the intro of this thing here yeah? okay very good guy. <laughs> Hi guys, so we've arrived at Havana here. It's hot and blazing as usual on a Trini day. So I just want to know from the girls before we go inside there, Gabby, what are you planning to order today? I'm gonna get a bacon shark. Bacon shark and you Gabby. Want a shark and bake. Shark and bake. Shark and bake. <laughs> so I don't know. I don't know what's right. Uh, shrimp and fries. Shrimp and fries. And uh, I don't know yet, but I'm thinking to mix it up. I'll have the kingfish and bake or kingfish and fries. I don't know yet. And by the way, any comments? Is it bacon shark or is it shark and bake? I find shark and bake songs a lot better, but I guess it makes more sense at bacon, bacon shark. shark. Babe, is it bacon shark or I shark say and bake? Shark and bake. Shark and bake? Yeah. I say shark and bake, but I have been made fun of, so. <laughs> <laughs> You've been ridicul ridiculed. Alright, guys, so anyway, when you pull up here, you may have to park in the car park if you're staying for an extended period of time, but otherwise, for a quick visit, you could probably park right on the side of the road here. And here is Havana, so let's go and check it out.
Hi guys, so after me harassing these people in the kitchen for like the last half an hour, we've finally been able to get the food. I'm out of the hair. So I'm gonna go through what we've taken at the end of the day. I'll start with Gabby. Miss Gabby. I got a bacon shark, shark and bake, with um, coleslaw, tamarind sauce, and then their special sauce, which I don't know what it is, but it tastes really good. <laughs> right, so Gabby got the bacon shark with special sauce in it, yes. which, which we don't know what it is. I guess it's a family secret. No. <laughs> so I actually um, end up filming some other shark and bacon side there as well because Gabby and Stephanie are very um, simple eaters sometimes Leorists. and I can let you know that even though if you want your bacon shark with just a few ingredients some people like it very simple and pure but other people like your thing filled to the brim with all kind of lettuce and pineapple and different things and I can assure you Havana will pack out your thing to the max you will get your money's worth here as you can see from my choice I told them they could go wild with my own. I end up taking the kingfish and fries. There's a felpa fries instead of bake. And on my own there, they put shadow benny, pepper, honey mustard, where else way? Tamarind sauce, ketchup. ketchup, salsa, cucumbers, lettuce. You have pineapple too. I have pineapple too. So I'm one of those people who goes the extra mile and if I pay you a certain amount of money for something, I gotta make sure and bankrupt your business by no. taking all the extra ingredients. Oh, Stephanie saying no, no. <laughs> and last but not least, wifey, what did you take? I got shrimp and fries with, uh, I think you put honey, mustard, garlic and ketchup. So shrimp and fries with honey, mustard, and garlic done. and ketchup. And fully loaded. It is very nice and fully loaded and you're getting very solid portions. The customer service is excellent. I spoke with the guy who might talk to us a little bit later again, but everything here is very well kept. It's very clean. They're running a very professional business here. I would argue by far the best option on Maracas Beach. I think Stephanie agrees with that. Well, they're running it like a restaurant. Yes. And like, it's they're so running it to like a restaurant, like so a good. proper restaurant. Proper. They do a very good job on their social media. Yeah. I think Gabby's seen it. I think mm -hmm. by far probably the best social media we've ever seen from a yeah. shark and big yeah, company. They're, really out there. they're up there. So yeah. Guys, we're gonna eat now, and maybe I'll take a little film of Maracas Beach after, but otherwise, come and check out Havana Titi. It's been fantastic, and I'm gonna dig into this food right now. Hi guys, so I've just finished eating my lovely meal here at Havana and I'm here with Daniel yeah. who is, if I'm not mistaken, one of the owners of this beautiful place. Daniel, is that yeah. correct? That's right, yeah. yeah. It, is, it is a family business. Bonus Bacon Shark has been here since the 1960s, you were telling me. Yeah. Yeah? And you've done, you said you've over the last two years you've tried to rebrand it into something. Yeah. What that, are you that, telling that me? That is a bit more engaging with persons enjoying the beach. It's a different look and feel and a different aesthetic. Definitely. Right. And I mean, when you step into it, you can tell from everywhere else on the beach that there's a very different aesthetic going on here. It's very beach vibes, but also very modern. It is, it is, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. What branches do you have currently or did you have before? All right, where we were previously, we had two locations. This is the original flagship location and we extended to, to Gulfview. We are looking at moving. So as of now, we, are, we haven't signed off for anything, but we are very hopeful that things kind of play off the way we hope to. And, but as it is right now, our sole location is at Maracas. Okay. I mean, best location anyway, although yes, you want more locations, but I mean, Shark and Bake, Maracas or Bake and Shark. Which one do you That's say? Right. Bacon shark. Bacon shark. It rolls off its tongue better. It rolls off its tongue yeah. better. I like yeah. shark and bake boy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I know everybody out there you go here to me, but trust me when I say it's shark and bake, not the man who's been doing this business yeah. for the longest <laughs> while now. He don't know what he's talking about, uh. you know? <laughs> so we had a fantastic meal today. Um yeah. everywhere in Trinidad for the most part suffered during COVID. How did you all manage during the time when we are not allowed to come to the beach at all? Yeah, it was tough. Just that's why we're depending on our second location in Gulfview. Okay. So for that entire period of that restriction, we actually closed off at Maracas. The traffic was a bit limited and it cost us more to open than, you know, otherwise. So we actually reopened at Maracas January the 1st. Since we closed at the second branch, we've reopened here. Okay. So, you know, we kind of segued the operation from there back to the flagship. All right. Yeah. And how have you seen growth from the, they, they opened the beaches until 12 
and yeah. now it was then 2 and then 6 p.m. Do you find that since the beach is open from 12 it was full steam ahead or has it gotten progressively better? Um, it was it was heavy from the start. It was heavy, heavy from, from the start. start. Yeah, people, That's good. They were, I mean, you're starving them of, of relaxation and leisure and I mean, they were just kind of boosted to kind of come out. So we, we, we actually saw that response and today is a Friday and it still feels like a uh, a Saturday before mm -hmm. COVID. Yeah, and it's yeah. early on a Friday too. This is probably going to get busier and busier as the day progresses. That's right. Too. That's right. Yeah. But you know, you don't need to tell me anything about starvation from beaches and things too. Because <laughs> I, if I had a choice, I would leave Stephanie home all day, every day, and spend all my time at the beach. And that is not a joke in any way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah no, not at all. But yeah, but Daniel, the experience has been fantastic. Your your business place pops out for the longest while now. Yeah. I love your food. Your portions. Yeah. No, no, it was good. It was good. The service is good. The standard is good. I, I spent more than 12 years in the hospitality industry and I, I can see when people doing things on a different level, you know? So I appreciate what you're doing there. Your social media is on point as I had my wife and her sister talking about as well. Congratulations and I hope your business booms into the future and that you, you all are super successful. Yeah, definitely. Yeah? Thank you so very much. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I appreciate the man. Yeah man, thank you. Did you slap it into his chest, eh? Oh no! Yeah. Well, I don't need to tell you, one of the best things about having bacon shark or shark and bake or whatever at Maracas is that right after you eat or after you swim, whatever order you want to do it in, you can walk out and you can look at this and take a sea bath.